Hi guys, I'm Rachel Gall, I'm Samantha Hartwell, and I'm the lead singer of the band. Hey guys, Luis Arguello here, guitarist of It's Gal, and I do vocals sometimes. Hey guys, I'm Gustavo, I'm the second guitar from, from the band, and yeah, I'm also doing some chorus and something like that you know, sometimes. Yeah. Hello everybody, Vlad here, and I play drums for Xcal. Hello guys, I'm Xcal. Well, all the plans have been postponed and were put on hold because of the pandemic. We had a nice start this year, uh, playing first time uh, in another place outside our country. Uh, we had a lot of uh, concerts to schedule. Uh, we also have our, our album release uh, uh, this year, so we had to cancel everything and postpone the, the release, the physical release and the concerts, and just uh, release the album uh, digital. So most of the concerts and, and gigs are postponed for now, and I think this is happening all over the world. It is happening all, all over the world. Well, the restrictions, I guess, are the same around the world. For example, our restriction is we go out with the last digit of the last number of, of our ID card. For example, this week can be number one to five. Next week can be six to zero. So basically, we're going out once every two weeks. And we also have a curfew from 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. But how are people coping with it? I think a lot of people are desperate, panicking. I guess everybody else is, and a lot of people are not following the instruction that that's given. So we're gonna see what what's gonna happen because if people are not following this, well, it's gonna be a total mess. The thing is that after almost three months of being on lockdown, here, everybody is start to, to, to panicking and and getting extremely stressed about being yeah, at home and just thinking what, what's yeah. going to happen. So it's, uh, it's really tough right here. But I guess that's happening everywhere. Um, well, you know, since we basically cannot go out as much as we used to, uh, and all of the shows were basically postponed or canceled, uh, we're not able to go out on the streets. We're not able to go in large gatherings. So um, whatever plans for this year, as far as shows, I don't think we're having any shows for the rest of the year, basically. So we'll have to see what happens to what happens for next year. Yeah, because even a lot of uh, international events were canceled. And, uh, yep. and well, it's, it's something that's happening everywhere. So. There's not much to do or, or even to, to, to say because we will have to wait uh, until all this craziness happens. Uh, happens. Yeah, yeah. A lot yeah. of bands cancel <clears throat> tours and all that and all that, and uh, so yeah, we'll have to see what happens. Yeah, we had the the original walk-in uh, qualifiers eliminatory. Uh, it was postponed from, from April to late June, but it seems that it was moved for next year. Also, so we're yeah, waiting. They made it a thing, actually. Yeah, actually, yeah. Uh, this uh, year's walk-in on Germany was canceled as well, and they moved everything to 2021. Okay. Yep, absolutely. Uh, the best uh, way for you to support a band is buying their merch, uh, buying their music uh, in on every platform, stream it. Uh, if they have a Bandcamp profile, go buy it. If they have if, if they have a CD on Amazon, go buy it. If they have uh, if they have merch, shirts, uh, whatever, just buy it. Because right now, that's basically the best way to support a band buying their merch, so that you know, so the band can uh, you know, subsist basically. And meanwhile, we're waiting for for shows to get back on and all that. So support your bands. And yeah, and, and I think that uh, you have to take advantage of the downtime from work and from everything else and be creative. Uh, be creative, uh, 
do music. Uh, this is the only thing. We, we live in a digital uh, world right now where, where everything can be shared. And so just do your thing and put on videos, put on quarantine videos as we have done so far <laughs> and have fun and make the best out of this. Yeah. And obviously stay safe, uh, stay strong because uh, we need it this time. We need it right now and as Black Faith, uh, support your band, especially the local band. Sure. Yes. <laughs> yes. If you have a local band that's you know promoting their themselves on Facebook and all that, go ahead and give them a like, follow them, and if they have merch, buy it. That's the only way bands survive nowadays, or right at this time. So yeah, support your local bands. Also, stay positive, maintain a positive mind. Like, do things at home to entertain yourself as well, so you don't go crazy. And be don't, safe, guys. Don't cut, really, you gotta take care of yourself. But, but don't cut your hair weird, weirdly. <laughs> <laughs> don't do yeah. stupid stuff, man. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> everyone, yeah. everyone has done it. Everyone, everyone has done something stupid. <laughs> I might no, shave no. my head though. <laughs> I think oh I'm God, don't do my that. Head. You already yeah. shaved the sides. You don't need to shave the whole thing. Nah, I might shave it. I cut well. my hair, guys. I mean, yeah, I, I, I also cut my hair. But it doesn't show because <laughs> I, I know how to cut it. <laughs> yeah, you can't. You can't really tell. <laughs> Hey guys, uh, thanks for the time, and um, uh, you can check our our stuff uh, on, on Facebook, on our page, on YouTube. We have our videos, uh, we have our music uh, yeah. all over the, the the digital platforms that uh, there can be. Uh, so uh, from Iskaz, that from Honduras, from Santiago Sula, uh, we invite you to to listen to our music. To listen to our stuff. Go to okay. xcal.bandcamp.com. All right, stay safe, guys. Uh, Take care. We'll be seeing you. Yeah. See you guys. Bye.